дать пацана посчитать потери Суммы нули погибают на сцене Снова один прогуляюсь без тени Заливаю лид пацаной на шее Эй, эй, камень там рад Правда назад, черный каскад Вижу твой взгляд, степь на горят Мог тебя взять, но ты не моя Так дать пацана посчитать потери Суммы нули погибают на сцене Снова один прогуляюсь без тени Заливаю лид пацаной на шее Эй, эй, камень там рад Назад черный каскад Вижу твой взгляд, степь на горят Мог тебя взять, но ты не моя Так дайте пацана посчитать потери Суммы нули погибают на сцене Снова один, прогуляюсь без тени Заливаю лид пацаной на шее Эй, эй, камень там рад Правда назад, черный каскад Вижу твой взгляд, степь на горят Мог тебя взять, но ты не моя Так дайте пацана посчитать потери Суммы нули погибают на сцене Снова один Welcome back, boys and girls, to another video. As you can see, we are not in the normal filming location of my house. We are indeed in Jacksonville, Florida, because today we have Caffeine and Octane in Jacksonville, Florida. It is their first ever one in Jacksonville, Florida. So I'm excited. I'm excited to see what the car scene is like in Florida. I've been to Florida many of times, and the cars here are way crazier than what we have in Georgia, unless you're, you know, in the Atlanta area. But with that being said, let's go ahead and warm her up. And it's about 7.30, it starts at 8, and let's get to the show. Come on, guys. I will be having a video up soon of stuff that I've done to the car. All right, number one is spacers. So as you can see, they are awesome. And uh, just for the record, they are 100% safe. This was a multi-100 mile trip, which is why I didn't get to make a video on it because it was very last minute that we had to come here. So video will be coming soon, but the spacers are holding up amazing and it makes the car look sick. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get y'all the normal cold stuff. Doesn't sound bad, she sounds healthy. Very, very healthy. A few inches later. Like two people come up to me, they were like, are you holding space for anybody? I was like, yep. Like, yeah, that's right. Holding space for the best car out here, boys and girls. She's home. She is home. Let's go. We are doing good today. Yes. Look at all these. Oh, she fits in perfectly. I'm so proud of her. We got this one. This one has GT500 front bumper and the hood which looks amazing. I'm a really big fan. What you think? Boys, look at what I saw. Okay, so if y'all don't know, back in the day, y'all probably don't know, I never mentioned it. Back in the day, we used to have an 07 Charger, right? So I see this 07 Charger in this beautiful color. I go, okay, cool. And then I see the Hellcat badge on it, and I go, what in the world is going on here? That's not right. And then I look, and uh, okay, yeah, no, justifiable, 100%, justifiable. Yeah, no, I'd, I'd put the Hellcat badge on there too. Wow, awesome, whoever did that, I'm super glad that you found a way to make that work. That is awesome. All right, so this is a beautiful GT500, right? Track pack, all right, it's got the huge wing in the back. Awesome, right? But uh, GT350R, all right? Not even the regular, but the R. You can tell because the wheels. And that back wing right there, look at that back wing. It's huge. I've seen so many people. I love this wing. I didn't even notice it's Shelby on the back. I love this wing, but the fact that so many people put it on their like GTs and Ecos and stuff, it made me not like it. But uh, yeah, GT350 stuff, I love the vents. Wheels are crazy, crazy expensive that is. And uh, yeah, they look good next to each other. They probably know each other and they park next to each other. That's cool. Volkswagen bus. Yo, this thing is dope. This is like a beach trip, uh, One Direction type uh, thing. <laughs> They're fishbowling hard, but I love it though. Dude, you ride this anywhere and people are going to be looking at you like, what is that? What is that? I love it. 
Boys, look at this Z06, all right? It looks good. I'm in love with the way it looks. I'm in love with the rims because they kind of resemble mine a little bit. Of course, his, his are chrome and mine are black, but they look good. But next to it, boom, ZR1. Looks crazy in person. Well, look at this back wing. Look at this back wing is mad. This part right here is the actual part of the engine right here. So when you open it up, all that is just a hole. GTR. Jeez. Jake, man, look at what you're missing, man. He was supposed to come with me today. If y'all don't know, he has a channel. I'll have it down below. But uh, look at what you're missing, man. You missed the Super. All right, yes, it is a Super. And he missed it. Oh my God, look at that turbo. I say that every time. Not only one, you missed another one. Oh, hey. And a third one. Just let me see that engine. Whew, look at that turbo. Oh my god. Yeah, it's awesome, man. Alright, boys. We got Audi TT RS, baby R8, next to the R8. A newer one, because the front looks a little bit different. But geez, these look good together. I love that color on the TT. But the white and the black on the R8 look crazy together. Look at that. Jesus Christ. Look at those brakes, man. And they got Michelin's on there. You already know Michelin game. Aventador. Finally, we get to see an Aventador. Last Caffeine Octane, there wasn't an Aventador, and I was very upset. Now, yeah, I didn't realize there wasn't one until after I got home and I started editing. I was like, we saw a Senna, but we didn't see an Aventador. I, I would have had, rather had the Senna, but look at this. Jeez. This is a regular one, I think. Look at how low you sit. Yo, that's crazy. Look at the inside. Yo, everything is so small in here. I love it. Okay, so just for comparison's sake, look at how tall the car is. It's right about here. Here, maybe? That's crazy. Hey man, what's up? What's up, man? My name is Pablo Savage. I'm out here working. Promote my YouTube channel. Should say Me too. YouTube. Yep, that's right. So that's right. I think we should support each other. Absolutely, <laughs> man. Yeah, let me get it. Let's get record each other and support each other, man. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> hey bro, shout out because I got the camera on you now. Hey man, this your boy Pablo Savage 392, man. I'm out here getting this content at the Cars and Coffee, man, with my guy Lightning Blue Eco. You that's know what I'm it. saying? Make sure y'all hit that channel. Like, comment, subscribe. Run it up, man. We're going to all 2021. Y'all know that. We all here. We all here. Thank you, bro. Good meeting you, man. Keep Good meeting you. Brother. Go look at your dream car, babe. Go look at your dream car. There it is. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> you said we we're gonna see one. This is her favorite car. If y'all don't know, this is her favorite car. I don't know why. I have no idea I love why. The color too. But uh, this is her favorite car right here. Oh yeah, the NSX. Sheesh. I love this. Okay, we gotta have a montage of this. We gotta have a montage of the NSX. Yeah. All right, all right. If all the cars, the NSX, right? Look at yeah. you. You can see. You can look on the inside too if you want. Windows are open. Go look. Go look. Be careful though. <laughs> yeah, she's so excited. Oh god, watch out, watch it. <laughs> hey, Dude, that's so cool. Remember we custom made an NSX on the website too? Yeah, we custom made an NSX on the website. Forza Horizon 4, we uh, custom made an NSX and that's the one she drives everywhere. So uh, yeah, no, don't forget about forget about all the Lamborghinis and Ferraris, the NSX, right? You can't love the new one without loving the old one. So what you think about the what you think about the OG? Yes, sir. This, this is mine. This is mine right here. I'll go crazy over this thing any day of the week. But what, what, what you think about it? What? What? But the, this started in the Fast and Furious, and, and it was the crazy NSX, and it it, but, but it was the predecessor. But 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 but. But but oh OG pop up headlights and a six. But, but this. That is 100% how it is, boys and girls. Guys, go crazy over this. Girls, go crazy over the new one. That's how it is. Ford GT. Oh, I've never seen one in person before. Look at this. Jesus. Look at the way the van just sinks in there. That is mad. Look at that. <laughs> the whole thing opens up and you can see the tire. I'm pretty sure new cars you can't even do that no more. It's like a regulation. And look at the inside. Jesus. It's like a virtual cockpit. Not a virtual cockpit. It looks like it's like a, a concept car. But it's real life. Dude. This thing is nice. Look at that. That is sick. 
Huracan Perfumante, just casually chilling. Awesome, I love this color. It's like a flat blue. Awesome. I love the exhaust on these. That's the reason why I like the Perfumante over the regular is because the exhaust, it just looks so much crazier. Yeah, and look at the engine. Man. Yeah, look at the inside. I think so. Jesus Christ. It's crazy in there. Everything's so small. Like you look at these supercars and you think that they're like normal size, like to normal cars. No. They're like like 0 0.75 times every other car. <laughs> then we got a super crazy white Huracan over here. Awesome. Awesome. You love to see it. Guys, look at how low this thing is to the ground. Jesus Christ, look at that boys. That is mad. I thought mine was low. <laughs> yeah, I'm not worried about mine no more. Look how low this thing is. I'm pretty sure it has a lift on it though, like a lift system to where you press it and it just lifts the suspension up if you want to clear a bump or something. It looks so nice. Everything he's done to this is super cool. White calipers, carbon fiber on the thing, black on the roof, black wing. Why are all these people crowding around? Must be something interesting. Boys. Oh my god, it's a Pagani. Hyra? Awesome. Dude, everything opens on this thing. Holy crap. <laughs> this thing is absolutely nuts. Look at that dude with the camera right there. His equipment, he got more equipment than me. Look at him, he's a professional professional. Man, look at this. This entire car is basically carbon fiber. I mean, pretty much. Look at that interior. Oh my god. Look at that. That is just different. And then look at the back wheel. That is just different. That is crazy. Look at the inside of this Urus. <laughs> Yo, this is money in here. I told you, I told you it has that, that leather smell. There's a certain type of smell that leather has that you only know if you have leather leather. Like, I have vinyl in my car. It's not real leather, but this is leather. But like, more expensive. Yes, yes. There's definitely a smell that you can, you can count as more expensive. <laughs> okay, so y'all see the Aventador, right? So, crazy supercar. Awesome, belongs here, right? Good section. But just across from it, we have a, a Mustang. And you're probably thinking, what's a Mustang doing with the with the supercars? And then you look at the back wheel and go, oh, 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 understood, ha have a great day. It, in the wise words of Mr. Cars Across Texas, he likes to party. Boys, look at this Lexus RCF. All right, five liter V8. And it looks crazy. They're very rare, you really don't see them around. They're crazy. I believe it's 476 or 72 horsepower. Y'all let me know. But beside of them, we have Godzilla 1, Godzilla 2, 3, and 4. The fourth being a Nismo. Woo! 5? Oh man. <laughs> In a row. There's no shortage of GTRs here. Look at this Nismo. This one's crazy. I mean, look at how low this one is. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yo. Awesome. There goes the lamb, though. Durango Hellcat. These things are rare. These things are so rare. Yo! Awesome! Dude, this thing is sick! Look at that! Imagine seeing an Hellcat logo on Durango! That is mad! Hey, yo, one of the best license plates I've seen! Gap Bus! <laughs> yo, it is though! <laughs> yo, that's dope! Look, boys! Hellcat wide body! 
Whoa. Something that like is known to be the tip top of everything is now. I've seen so many of them. It's crazy. I still love it though. This thing is crazy. You see this on the road? It's absolutely crazy. Beautiful. Look, boys and girls, we got a 720S. It's a McLaren 720S looking beautiful. Awesome. Ooh, look at the interior. It matches. Cool. Look at that. Got the vertical screen. It's so small, but so nice. And in the back of it, awesome. It's got a very very unique look to it, all right? It steps away from the McLaren look while also looking awesome at the same time. Look at those doors. Jesus. And if one wasn't enough for you, there's another one just sitting, just chilling with the doors up. Jesus Christ. I like this one. I like it with the black hood because then it, it contrasts really nicely. I like it. Dude, look at that back wing. Jesus. We got a beautiful 458, I believe. I get the 458 and the 488 so mixed up, but it looks beautiful. Look at that. Awesome. So low to the ground. The interior is beautiful. Look at that classic Ferrari. Looks beautiful. Look at that engine in the back. Oh my god, yes sir. Look at this Charger. Definitely one of the more unique cars out here. Now, my parents being the owner of a 07 Charger, I always looked up to the Super Bs. This is a Super B. So these things look crazy. But, fun fact, these only came in an auto and they only were a four speed. I don't know if they changed that later or if they changed that with the uh, Super B. But I know ours was a four speed. So now with my 10 speed, I have 2.5 times more gears in my car <laughs> than uh, the, one of these chargers, but beautiful. Of course, they did their own little styles to it. Look at the wheels. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh man, I love the shape of these so much. And the Crasher 300 still keep the shape. Now y'all already know I had to come back to the Supra. You always, always have to come back to the Supra. Oh, I love these. I want one so bad. I definitely own one. Deal with all of its hardships, everything it's got to offer. It's beautiful. Look at that rear windshield wiper, yes. Well, I guess back window wiper, right? And in the back, beautiful. And you got another one. I'm not gonna lie to you guys though, I really do like this spoiler more. This is my type of spoiler. This one's cool too, but I like the OG. Look at that, that is crazy. Dude, look at that. It's crazy. It's an auto, cool. I like how there's that extra front that lip right there it goes very well with it i want to get one of these taken off man i really do oh i hope i get to signal the end of the video thank y'all so much for watching i will say i enjoyed this one maybe just a little bit more than the uh, one in atlanta 
mainly because I feel like there's way more variety here. I mean, the parking lot where people just parked, it's not a part of the actual show, was well, just as crazy, if not more crazy than the actual show. We saw so many, we saw Ford GT, we saw Pagani Hyra. It's crazy. I mean, they got some crazy cars out here. Now, every time I went to Florida, I've always seen crazy cars, but they're literally just everywhere. Like, you cannot go anywhere without seeing a crazy car in one place or another. So, this has been awesome. I hope to come to some more. It is the same distance as Atlanta. It's pretty much exactly three hours each way, so I can go to both, and I'm hoping to go to both. That guy that I met, Pablo Savage 392 I'll have his channel right here. Go subscribe to him. He's a super cool dude, super nice guy. He came to me out of nowhere, and he was like, bro, I want to support you you support me and that's what I come here to do I come here to meet people and get motivation from these cars so that's exactly what it's about I'm super glad I met him super cool guy and I really want to meet him at future ones if I see him I'm definitely gonna say hi to him oh uh, I saw the had a shirt on that had his name on it I really want to get one support the man cool guy I love that guy but with that being said guys thank you so much for watching like subscribe and I'll see y'all in the future video